to my channel. We're gonna do things a little bit different today. I know for the past month, maybe two months, maybe three, we've been heavy into my training and my competition, but I wanted to bring things back a little bit to fashion. You guys know I love fashion and spring is, if not here, almost here. So I wanted to give you guys some inspiration. This video it will not necessarily be a haul because a lot of the pieces that I will be showing are pieces that I already have. So I want to show you how to mix and match your old with your new and make things work and stretch your budget a little bit. So anyway, without further ado, let's get on into the fashion. Okay, here we go. This first look is a fashion over top and bottom piece. These jeans are high-waisted, bronze coated. They're kind of fun. And we paired it with an off the shoulder top, button up top that we tied at the waist to kind of define and accentuate the waist. I love the sleeves on this. I usually have the problem of short sleeves, but this is perfect. The shoes are by JNVK here in Austin. And I paired this outfit with a clutch from Zara that you can wear with or without the strap. This next look is also Zara heavy. Uh, the top and bottom are from Zara. The shoes are Fashion Nova. And I actually purchased these shorts in Brussels, so kind of cool. And I paired it with a military jacket from Banana Republic that I've had for a few years. And I added a couple of brooches to kind of make the look fun. The top is also from Zara, and I love the detail on the back. This look is one that I think is cool. I wore it to the bar with a girlfriend, all white jeans from The Gap. This sweatshirt is from Banana Republic, another piece that I've had for a while. The shades are Christian Dior, and the hat is another favorite of mine from H&M. And I paired it with a crossbody from YSL, Yves Saint Laurent. And I paired the look with a pair of fun sneakers from Sam Edelman. My mom got me these for Christmas. I love the puff balls. So this look, I hate to call a trend because I feel like African prints have been around forever, but we're seeing a lot of it. This set is from Sonia B Boutique and I paired it with a black tank top, probably from The Gap. I love the matchy matchy look going on here and I'm showing off my legs. And I tucked the strap on that same YSL clutch and paired it with this outfit as well. Another statement piece, uh, So Kate's by Christian Louboutin. You're probably starting to notice that I make the investment in some of my accessories. I like to make investments in classic pieces. Uh, moving on to this look. I believe I purchased this dress from Shein. Shein, sorry. I like the dress. It has some fun details. I love the bow that you see there. And it also has peekaboo shoulders. I paired it with some over the knee boots by Mark Fisher. These boots are suede. So another bit of fun texture. And again, I paired it with the YSL clutch. And that H&M hat again. If you can't tell by now, I love off the shoulders. I hope this moment stays with us forever. But um, these are Fashion Nova jeans. You've seen me in these many, many times. And this top is by Zara as well. 
Here we are again with those statement pieces, YSL clutch, Christian Louboutin shoes, and I also paired it with my favorite leather jacket from Boda Skins. My feet were burning, y'all, but all for fashion. Most of these looks, or all of these looks, were very affordable. The pieces ranged from $20 to $50. Of course, the shoes and my purse and the leather jacket are a little bit more expensive, but as I said, I, I prefer to make investments in classic pieces. All right, guys, as usual, thanks for watching. Please make sure you are subscribed and go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Let me know down below if you like this or if there was something you didn't like and you want to see a little bit more of this. And yeah, I'll see you the next time.